Which sentence is missing a subject? Let's go through our choices and see if we can locate the subject in each one. A. Sentence 3. According to the World Sleep Society, sleep deprivation is threatening the health of up to 45% of the world's population. A simple way to go about locating the subject of a sentence is by asking who or what. For example, with this sentence, we can ask ourselves, what is threatening the health of up to 45% of the world's population? The sentence tells us, sleep deprivation is. As sleep deprivation is our subject, we can mark this choice as incorrect. B. Sentence 4. Depending on our age, we are supposed to get between 7 and 10 hours of sleep each night. With this sentence, we can ask ourselves, who? Who is supposed to get between 7 and 10 hours of sleep each night? The sentence tells us, we are. As we is our subject, we can mark this choice as incorrect. C. Sentence 8. Stopping smoking, drinking only in moderation, if you drink at all, eating a well-balanced diet, exercising, staying mentally active, and keeping your blood pressure and cholesterol levels in check are excellent ways to keep brains and bodies healthy, experts say. Here we can ask, what are excellent ways to keep brains and bodies healthy? Our answer, as the sentence tells us, is the entire opening phrase, stopping smoking, drinking only in moderation, etc. As this is our subject, this can be marked as incorrect. And D, sentence 9. Can also tackle any sleep problems by training your brain for better sleep. Who can tackle any sleep problems by training your brain for better sleep? The sentence doesn't tell us. It's missing a subject, most likely the subject you. As this sentence doesn't have a subject, we can go ahead and mark it as our final answer.